Welcome to our behind-the-scenes tour of how bowling balls are made. From raw materials to the final polish, we'll take you through every step of the fascinating process. Let's get started. Bowling balls are the most essential equipment in the sport of bowling. These precision-engineered spheres come in various weights, sizes, and materials, tailored to match different playing styles and lane conditions. From recreational bowlers to professional athletes, the right bowling ball can significantly impact performance, making it a fascinating blend of science, craftsmanship, and personal preference. Today, we're diving into the intricate process of how these remarkable pieces of sporting equipment are made. Our journey begins here, at one of the top bowling ball manufacturing plants in the world. Let's head inside. Bowling balls start with raw materials. The core of the ball is typically made from a dense material like resin or urethane. These materials are delivered to the factory in large quantities and stored until they're ready to be used. The first step in production is creating the core. Workers mix the materials and pour them into molds to form the inner core of the ball. The core is crucial for determining the ball's weight and performance. Once the cores have hardened, they're removed from the molds and carefully inspected for any defects. Next, the core is placed into another mold where the cover stock will be added. The cover stock is the outer layer of the ball and plays a significant role in how the ball reacts on the lane. The cover stock material, often made from a combination of resin and additives, is poured into the mold around the core. The ball is then left to cure and harden.
Bowling balls have a fascinating history that spans thousands of years and reflects the evolution of materials and technology. From their ancient origins in Egypt and medieval Europe to the modern, high-tech designs used today, bowling balls have undergone significant transformations. Early balls made from stone and hardwood have given way to advanced materials like rubber, plastic, urethane, and reactive resin. These changes have dramatically improved the performance and precision of bowling, making it a beloved sport worldwide. This journey of innovation highlights the continuous quest to enhance the game, making bowling more enjoyable and competitive for enthusiasts of all levels. Once the ball has cured, it's time to shape it. The ball is removed from the mold and placed on a lathe, where it is precisely shaped to ensure a perfect sphere. Next, holes are drilled into the ball for the fingers and thumb. This step is customized for each player, with measurements taken to ensure a perfect fit. The final steps involve polishing and finishing the ball. The ball is sanded and polished to achieve the desired surface texture, which can affect how it behaves on the lanes. Each ball is carefully inspected to ensure it meets the highest standards of quality. Only then is it ready to be boxed up and shipped to bowling alleys and retailers around the world. And there you have it. From raw materials to a finely tuned piece of sporting equipment, that's how a bowling ball is made. Next time you're at the lanes, you'll have a greater appreciation for the craftsmanship that goes into each role. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more behind the scenes looks at how your favorite products are made.